What is good? Back again with your old mate Mutt. Like, comment, subscribe, do all of those good things, and enjoy the video. That's not you at all. Where's... God damn it. Lady Legs, she died. <sighs> well, random horse. I guess it's you and me then. Yeah. At least now we can talk to Mary. Disturb you, ma'am. Um, is um, is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton, a collar for you. It's a man or a bear. Hello, Arthur. Mary. I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Where's what's-his-name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh... Well, you've been... <clears throat> you've been made a widow and you come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that. Arthur. Oh, okay. I... I wear a bad head now. I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. <laughs> I always liked Jamie. At least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... but I think of you often. <laughs> Long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please. Arthur, will you help me? Cause I help you, Mary. Where is he? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. I have a feeling we're not getting paid for this one, Blondie. 
Alright. Yep, yep, and giddy up. So all it took was for me to die horrifically. And uh, then I was able to do the mission. Makes perfect sense. Comedy Hill, a hey. Like a hell of a run. You ain't no lady legs, I'll tell you that much. I so can. up and died on me, twisted my ankle something fierce. Think you could give me a ride? Yeah, sure. Hop on. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. You know Emerald Ranch? Mind taking me there? Sure. Glad I ran into you. Huh. I raised that horse, you know. Raised it since it was just a foal. Oh, uh, losing a horse is hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, that horse did right by me. Better than my husband, truth be told. That fool, always complaining, but does he do something about it? Man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away, aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage, for me, has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit, he was a fine animal. Loyal, smart... Brave. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once. I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off, but I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Kicked his hide, too, as he was hollering away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Oh, yeah? Good old biscuit. Yeah. Had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell I husband, horse. what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <laughs> so, you live at Emerald Ranch, then? Hold up. For the time being. I was Who looking for work. What you want? Just passing money. through, that's it. If I All waited right. any longer, yeah, too for careful with strangers. Someone recently robbed a very nice station. stagecoach of mine. Hey, my damn we son's disappearing off gallivanting again. I want you gone. We gonna move oh, at some don't point, don't or is this me. it? Anyways, right. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. How so? The owner's a mean bastard. Strange, too. Delights in bullying folk. There's a daughter, but she never leaves the house. You can see her in the window sometimes. When I asked about her, everybody told me to leave it alone. Found an old saloon there, all shut down now. But I went in to have a look, and there's bullet holes, old blood stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an okay. uncomfortable feeling to the place. Sorry. Hey, we can't walk your horse back. Come on! Hey, what are you doing? Get back on your horse! Can you not see me picking flowers? 
you have no priorities. No, 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 no. What in the world? Oh, yeah. Wait. Lady. It was a misclick. I'm gonna get you back to the ranch. It's fine. Please no. I wanna hear the rest of the story. Ah, you choke one woman and suddenly you can't be trusted.